All right, well, we love our Monday traditions here of good news. It's always fun to hear about all the good things going on in your life. So this week we had to Jetty Park to see what's making you smile. Well, I woke up on this side of the dirt. Okay. Uh, I go to the gym and come fishing. And do you eat the fish that you, yes. that you catch here? Yep. Last, uh, I think two weeks ago, I caught a pretty good sized stingray and a lot of people don't know that you can eat stingray, mm -hmm. but we uh, uh, set it in some lemon juice for about an hour and then fried it up. Tides are great this week. Um, usually, well, I think today it might be around three o'clock is high tide and bait fish come in and it's just peaceful out here. So you're kind of tired, but that's kind of good news. Yeah, it's good news. I literally drove nonstop all the way from Texas. And instead of staying in hotels for a work trip, I looking around, they actually have camping right here on the water. So trying to enjoy myself and make a difference out here in Florida, working on some political issues and uh, then traveling a lot in life and get to enjoy this beauty. But I come here every day because it's peaceful. It's a mental thing since I've been retired. Yeah. It's very nice to come out here and just enjoy the beautiful weather. And work on your tan. Uh, well, I, I try not to. I, I use sunscreen. Uh, sunscreen. Got it. Yeah. How's, how's my tan? Does it, does it work? Candace, you're getting there. Just I'm getting there. Don't spend too much time in the sun. <laughs> I, I won't, I won't. So what's your good news? My good news is that uh, my children are doing well, my grandchild as well. Uh, we're retired, everything's paid for. Uh, so our kids have nothing to worry about. Oh. We're dead and buried. I, I mean, we're, we're just, it, it, it's, it's an inner peace that you get mm -hmm. when everything is taken care of, when you have children and grandchildren. That was some good news of our own happening right there. Karen Gill has worked at the front desk of our station more than 25 years, greeting visitors and answering all sorts of calls. And last week, she went through her last treatment for breast cancer and rang that bell at the Florida Cancer Specialist and Research Institute to celebrate that grand occasion. And her battle isn't over just yet, but she's a fighter, and she obviously has love and support from her family and, of course, the new six family. So it was a, it was a great place to be yes. know, that day. What a great day. And I hope you took a nice look at her sweet face because when you're upset and yes. you call the front desk and you yell at someone, that's her. Yeah. Please don't do that. Yeah. She's so sweet. When we're we in a tornado Karen. warning and we have to cover <laughs> over certain television programming, it's not our fault, especially, and it's especially not her right. fault. Poor little Karen. So just send us your hate email. Yes. Don't yell at her. Yeah, just email yeah. us. Yeah.